Hi guys, I'm so glad to be bringing you another DIY today. This is my little sister and in today's video I'll be sharing with you guys how I made the fabric of a necklace that she is wearing. Let's get into the video. Please check the description box for more information such as measurements and stuff. So this is my fabric. I had about four of these fabrics. This is something that you can make from fabric scraps. And so I measured about four centimeters. And then I just started marking at the edge of the fabric. So the length definitely depends on how you want your necklace to be, on how long you want your necklace to be. And you also have to bear in mind that as you weave the fabric, it gets shorter and shorter. But I think in my opinion, the best length was probably around 50 centimeters. And then I started ironing, I started folding both edges inwards and then ironing them and then folding it in half again to close all the raw edges. The 4 cm strip will now come back to be about 1 cm in width. And then I did this for the remaining of the four strips that I had. So all in total I had four strips. So when I had all my four strips, I took a little metal clamp and then I gathered all the four strips and I put them together and I put it in between the metal clip and I used my pliers to just pinch it shut and make sure that nothing is escaping. Then I taped it onto the table to help me when I weave. So the way I do this, the way I understand it is I always take the one that is at the edge and then I weave it in between the other two such that I take that then I go over, under and over. It takes a little bit of getting used to so it's over under and over again 
that is just how I have understood it. And I always start with the strip that is at the end. The one that is on my left. And I weave it going towards the right. I'm going to try and put in a few links in the description box where you can get like explanations or something like that. Like if I'm not explaining it in a way that you understand, I'm going to try and find other sources that you can refer to and maybe hopefully they can help you. So I just kept on doing that. I just keep on weaving and weaving until I get to the length that I think is suitable enough to make a necklace out of. And then when I get to that length, I just cut off the extra strips and then I use another metal clamp and then I just clip it again with my pliers. So that is how it looks like at that point. And then the next thing now is to put in some jump rings and a metal hook and a chain. So I did use a lobster hook. And that is almost the finished product and then I did press it however with an iron just to get it like nice and flat and make sure that the shape stays in place.